slick. It is very slick. so bad. All right. We're going to hit up Redman Trail. Redman, I do believe Emma Redman is the uh, what this trail is named after. And uh, she had a lot to do with this area. Google her. Just put Redman Ferncliff State Park you should get some pretty cool information and uh, tell you more about the early days of this park how it all started stuff like that it's very cool short little hike oh, here we go Mike hike with Mike more cool rock formations I get them for you Bubba Oh yeah, Fern Cliff is pretty cool after it's rained a whole lot. <laughs> that cool little natural shelter. Oh, there's like a little squirrel or a rodent, maybe a rat. Just trying to stay dry. Wow, that's cool. Very cool. Cool little like sandy little Oh yeah. We got us a waterfall. Oh, looks like that's a trail. We got us a couple waterfalls. They're not the biggest waterfalls out here, but they're still pretty cool. That's for sure. Alrighty, so I made it up without sliding too much. That's where I gotta be really careful. Obviously, it's not that much of a fall, but it still hurt. <laughs> That's slick. It is very slick. All right, because of how slick it is and with the amount of water, I decided to play it safe. I'm just going to cross the creek. Whoop. 
to get to the other part of the trail. Made it across. Check out this little side trail. Very cool. Very cool indeed. Alrighty, here's some information on Emma Redman. I think you'll appreciate this, Tracy. Dedicated to the memory of Emma Redman, teacher and conservationist, or conservationist, who owned and lived on 120 acres of this park and preserved its natural beauty. In 1923, Miss Redman's property was named the most beautiful spot in Illinois. In 1949, she deeded, deeded it to the state of Illinois as part of the state park system. Miss Redman loved this area for its beauty, and it is said that her favorite quotation was, to him who in the love of nature holds communion with her visible forms, she speaks a various language for his gayer hours. Emma Redman, 1864 to 1951. So, thank you, Emma. We can thank her for this awesomeness that she has preserved for us. I like the fact that they named a trail after her. And we're done with the loop. Hopefully I didn't miss anything when I decided not to uh, cross over the waterfall. But like I said, I just want to play it safe because it's so wet and slip slippery right now. If you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. Feel free to comment and tell me what you thought of the trail, what your favorite part was, more places you'd like me to go. Please share this video, especially on social media. The more people watch me, the more people subscribe, the more I'm motivated to keep making these videos. If you're not a subscriber yet, hit that subscribe button. You can also hit the little bell button, and that will notify you when I upload new videos. Thanks for watching, hiking with Sean, and I'll see you on the trail.